Here's a question about baby's gums in the 2x4 early prevention dental health program. How do I clean, which I think is, there are a number of ways that you might be able to share with us, how do I clean the baby's gums and how often do I do that? Okay, so um, uh, how do you clean the uh, baby's gum is uh, make sure your hands are clean. That's number one. We don't, we don't want to introduce uh, bacteria from our hands in, in our baby's mouth. So it never hurts if we really wash our yes, hands when yes. we do things. Yes. Uh, and uh, get, get a clean cloth and just wet it with water. Uh, at this stage, it's very important to avoid uh, toothpaste. No and, toothpaste, any toothpaste yet. Because uh, the baby will swallow it. Uh, um, they're not developed enough to know how to spit at this stage. So just avoid uh, using toothpaste. Except milk when it comes back up. I'm not going there though. I had it all down me once. Anyway, keep going yeah, here. So, cleaning, uh, yes. Yeah, so just cleaning uh, basically every surface that you see on, on, the, on the gums in their mouth. Um, and uh, just, just gentle uh, pressure and uh, make sure that it's clean. And um, Once a day? Once a day because uh, there's not much bacteria. So at, at this stage we're simply um, introducing that the good habit. Good habit of doing this. Yes, and um, once a day is good because the diet is, is not, um, there's not a lot of sugar too much uh, in, in the baby's diet. So once a day is good and also it depends on when they're, they're awake, when, when they're sleeping and the, it's not as, um, their routine is, is a little bit different from ours where we, we sleep at a certain time and we wake up a certain time. So babies yes, can, that's true. are unpredictable. So, yes, uh, are. so once, uh, once a day is good and plus mommy is probably exhausted from uh, lack of sleep so once it is is very very good and just following up on that so dr. Julie I mean at what point do you actually start I mean I know we've talked about that at two months you're you're encouraging moms to bring the child in but at what age are you actually starting to do this procedure of trying to you know help uh, take care of the gums I mean right away you can or? do it right away okay right away um, again it's a very uh, non-invasive procedure um, the same way you you bathe them mm -hmm. right away um, right that's probably one of all so there's no thing. there's no reason to no, have to and wait there's no, to there's, no con there's no harm in doing it mm -hmm. and again it's just for you also to make sure things are right to make sure it's no concern um, sometimes they could have infection in the mouth um, you know so maybe you could be born with certain condition present in the mouth as well um, so there's no harm in doing that but it's just a, a good habit to take and a good routine um, if you forget it's not the end of the world either but just picking up that routine so then later on it's a good trans transi transition mm -hmm. um, to brushing to the when teeth the teeth actually yes. show yes. up yeah and I got to imagine it, it, I was just thinking of this as you were saying it but it right off the bat gets you to have a baseline of what things look like right away so you're going to immediately recognize changes as they're happening and be able to report them to your dentist yes, definitely. Right. okay